only an extremely lucky 2% of the population have dry earwax. That's because there's a single gene called the ABCC11 gene which codes for the dry earwax and it also codes for stink-free armpits. Not all ethnicities were made equal on this point though, as if you look at some areas in the Far East, then over 75% of people actually have the ABCC11 gene, coding for the dry earwax and stink-free armpits, but in the West, we're looking at more than 97% of people who have the wet earwax. What's even more interesting is because of cultural trends and what the majority of people do, those with the ABCC11 gene actually still use things like deodorant and shower daily, even when for their specific situation, it may not be necessary. One of the downsides to the dry earwax though is it may be more likely to clump inside the ear and be more difficult to remove. Which do 